things like mine's pretty dreadful. It's totally and utterly rubbish. Exactly. But if yeah. someone said to you, how would you feel about running 31 marathons in just one month? I don't yeah. know how you feel. I think it would be impossible. I think it would be impossible, but it is not impossible. Exactly, because that's exactly what Gerard Varin has done, mm -hmm. and he's returned home. He has returned home, actually. When did he finish it? He finished it on he finished Tuesday. He finished it on Tuesday, and he arrived back tonight. He went all the way from Duffield in Derbyshire to Switzerland, raising money for breast cancer. Well, he is back tonight, and he's been welcomed with a surprise party, and Simon Ward was there. <laughs> Cheering home their marathon hero. Gerard Varin has run more than 800 miles from his home in Duffield to his birthplace in Switzerland. He wasn't expecting such a big welcome. No, it's wonderful. Yeah, I knew they were preparing something, but I thought it was a lot closer to home. Certainly not at the station. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah. And so, 31 marathons in, in 31 days, the equivalent of how are you feeling? Uh, Feeling, feeling okay actually, yeah, the, the leg's a bit swollen but uh, it's because I've not had time to put them up yet. <laughs> so yes, if I could do with a massage I think. <laughs> it's incredible, we just keep putting that money in and it's gone over 26 today which is fantastic, it's absolutely brilliant. Gerard decided to raise the money after he realised he knew nine local people who were affected by cancer. I think it's a huge amount of money and I think it'll make a massive, massive difference. The more research they can do, hopefully, the more prevention that they can do and cures, hopefully. And Gerard's last journey of the day was another surprise. Thank you everybody for coming. A ride home in a 1930s Austin. Simon Ward, East Midlands today at Duffield in Derbyshire. And he wasn't even sitting down in the car either, was he? I was just like, <laughs> Exactly, but if I was him after all of that running, that I would be going everywhere by car yeah. now. And I know that's not the environmental thing yeah, to say, right, but... Actually. He doesn't want to party, he wants to put his legs up.